<gasps> yeah, we got the sword. Oh, oh, oh no! What's the timer for? <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome to GGS Game, and today we're looking at the opening bits of Minute, which is an adventure game where you can only, sort of, like, you only live 60 seconds at a time to complete, a, like, it's loads of different quests. Um, at the moment you can obviously see there's no timer on screen, and it's because we've only just started. So this is actually a new game, we're just going to look at the very early parts because I don't want to ruin it for all you guys. So, um, yeah, it's a game being published by Devolver Digital, and it's being actually made by only four people. Uh, who go by the name of Lambier as the development name. So guys, when we pick up this sword, first of all you're going to see like just how kind of they take a lot of inspiration from Zelda and stuff like that, but also this will actually start the game. So, <gasps> yeah, we got the sword. Oh, oh, oh no, what's the timer for? Just, oh no. But look, we got a sword now, so yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm so powerful. Yeah. Also, I would just like to point out that something I absolutely love about this game is the music, so I'm just going to shut up for a second just so you can actually enjoy that. Wait, wait for the drop. It's great. Here comes the drop. Oh, yeah. Not really a drop, but still, it's good. It's good, I really like the music. So guys, um, right, we got our sword, hey yeah, and we've only got 15 seconds left to live, so we're going here to for this time once. If only someone would take care of those five crabs, you used to be a lot busy here. Right, so. What we're going to do is let ourselves die and then we're going to go and get rid of those crabs. Ouch. So yeah, a lot of people have said that the design kind of looks like, um, takes off the undertone, which I think, oh, I get that, I think, you know, black and white, and the sharp pixels and stuff like that. But, as well, obviously, the mechanic itself, you know, if uh, you've seen Groundhog Day, it's a bit like that, or it's a bit like, um, obviously Majora's Mask or something like that. The gameplay itself, though, obviously takes after, you know, early Zelda games. So here are the crabs, just get rid of those. Yeah. And then, we come back to the... Yeah, we got the coffee. Got some delicious coffee, which allows us to... Which one to... And so guys, you can see that you know, this is going to be the bulk of the game, is completing little quests and then um, being able to uh, get new tools which allows you to go and explore different parts of the map and stuff like that. So, that's the first part of our adventure done. Good work guys. So, um, part of all of us, we all really helped out there. Duck. Oh no, oh, couldn't talk to a duck because they died. Right then, so, as you can see guys as well, yeah, every time you wake up you, um, Every time you start again, sorry, you wake up in your house. So, so I can be careful. Okay, well, I don't want to go in dark anywhere because we haven't got things to light it up. So, what we'll do is go back to where we were before. Kind of just explore around there a bit more. Let's go up here. Make more the crabs. I don't want any trouble crabs, got I beef with you this time. Right. Uh -huh, see? Ah, the key. Let's get the key. Yeah, we got the lighthouse key. Right then, to the lighthouse with only 20 seconds left. Can we make it? I'm sure we can. Double the light patch. Right. Oh no, I have no time for you. Quick. Oh no, I put it make it. Why did I try and speak for the Yeah, oh, I got the flashlight. I'm amazing. Right, and just in time for me to die. So guys, you can see, yeah, like, even though six seconds isn't very long, you can see already in the early starts anyway that they kind of space everything out well enough so that you can actually get to where you need to go. Ooh, scary snake temple. Right. So obviously you can kill these snakes if you want, but you can actually just get through. Ooh, go. Ooh, dangerous go. Run. Do, 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 do. 
Right, and guys, you can see that if you come in here, yeah, new home selected. And this is something that the game does, just to mean that, you know, you're not always having to rush around from the early part. You, you know, you unlock different houses as you go along and stuff. Okay, it does make it a lot easier. Not easier, by any means that, you know, you know, it makes a bit more sense rather than expecting to be able to do everything. Now. Right, so, guys, I think what we're going to do is we are going to do one more little adventure. Then, we'll probably call it a day there, just because I don't want to ruin it. It is quite a short game, I mean, that you get a trophy for completing the game in 25 minutes. So, I really don't want to ruin it for you guys. So if we come down here... Oh wait, no. I don't need to look at it. <laughs> a minute. Right. Okay, there we go, lost person, someone helped them. So if we come down here, here he is. Oh, he wants water. I have no water. Oh, does that help? No, I'm not helping. Right guys, what we do need to do though, is die quickly, obviously. We always need to die. And then, we may need to go back to where we were quickly. Because, there we've got something we can actually use to help that poor guy. Through the snake tunnel. Oh, sorry guys, I have no time. Yep. Yeah, just for the sake of time. Yeah. Right, so, um, yeah, this is something that you should really do as soon as you can, guys, get the water can, because you're going to need that. The cool thing about the water can is that it will, um, it will just wait outside your house for you. Right, come on then. And then obviously, yeah, with the water and can, I imagine you guys know what we'll do next. We'll just go and water that man in the desert. Here we go. Phew. Right. Let's go water someone. Oh no, where are you? I'm still a day. Okay. Yeah, you save my life. Come see me at the sign maker. I have no time for that, cause I'm about to die. Da, da, da. Just annoying him now. <laughs> oh. Okay guys, that was a very quick look at Minute. It's out today. It's only like £7 on console, I think in England, and then in America it's about $10. So, if you are looking for a new indie game, this is definitely worth checking out. I mean, I've really enjoyed it. I've played through it a couple of times now. And it has been an absolute pleasure to play, you know, the design is really cool and the music is really cool. So if you are looking for a new indie game to play, guys, this is it. If you've enjoyed this, guys, please do like and subscribe. Uh, let us know if you're playing Minute or any other kind of games that you think are quite similar to this in its mechanics or style or anything like that. And please do subscribe as well, guys, okay? So thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.